So ascites is a serious complication of advanced liver disease. What do we do when we develop ascites? Well, the first thing is to look at diet and to cut down on the amount of salt in the diet and not add salt to the food. And there's lots of foods out there that contain a lot of salt, particularly foods that are from takeaways or from restaurants. They have a lot of salt in them. Asian food has a lot of salt, so soy sauce, oyster sauce, and those other sauces that might go with food have a lot of salt in them. So the first step is to really look at the salt in the food and reduce the amount of salt being consumed. The next thing is to perhaps have fluid tablets, and your GP or your specialist will be able to guide on this, but fluid tablets can increase the amount of fluid that's going out through the kidneys and reduce the amount of fluid that's accumulating in the legs or in the belly. So in people with really severe ascites or, or fluid accumulation in the belly, they might get really, really distended and it causes a lot of pain. Now we can put a little drain into the belly to drain that fluid out directly and we can drain six, eight, ten litres of fluid out and cause really quite dramatic benefit in terms of the symptoms related to that swelling. Now sometimes we can do that every few weeks. But that means that every few weeks somebody is coming to the hospital and needing to have that drain put into the belly to drain fluid. So there are other things that we can do. Some people will be assessed for a procedure called a TIPS. And that's where we put a little metal tube inside the liver to redirect the blood flow in the liver and to reduce the pressure and reduce the accumulation of that fluid. Other people will rec recommend that they have regular infusions of albumin which is a protein that the body normally makes but is now made synthetically and available in a little bottle. And if we give a couple of bottles of albumin per week, every, every week, that can reduce the need for having drainage procedures of the fluid and make people feel a lot more comfortable and keep them out of hospital.